there are better ways to keep cool. Call KS Services and receive a new Bryant unit with no payments and no interest for 18 months. Stay cool now and pay later. Visit callks.com for more. This is your weather video for Tuesday morning, December 29th, 2020. I'm Scott Martin, sitting in for a vacationing James Spann. The sun will play peekaboo behind some clouds today and tomorrow before rain and storms move in late on New Year's Eve and hangs around through the morning hours of New Year's Day. We'll get to that in just a moment. As we start off the morning at sunrise, temperatures will be bottoming out in the mid-30s to the mid-40s across the area. Birmingham should be around 40 degrees. The cold spot in central Alabama looks to be Gadsden as they may drop to 34 degrees. Alexander City may win out as the warm spot at 45 degrees. Now jumping to the 0Z run of the GFS, valid today at 3 p.m., we'll see that the cold front that moved through the area on Monday will now be well to our south. Unfortunately, skies will continue to stay partly to mostly cloudy throughout the day. The good news is that temperatures will be mild for this time of the year, reaching the mid-50s to the mid-60s, just over the normal highs for the end of the year. A strong cold front will be getting its act together west of us on Wednesday, which will put us in the warm, moist air infection out ahead of it. Clouds will build and skies will be mostly cloudy. At this point, rain looks to hold off well after midnight, so hunt day looks to stay dry. Highs will be in the lower 60s to right around 70 degrees. This run of the GFS has slowed the eastward progression of the cold front and holds the scattered rain and storms off from entering central Alabama until the mid to late morning hours on New Year's Eve. The much heavier activity will move in during the evening and late night hours. During this time, a few strong to severe storms may be possible. The Storm Prediction Center has the southern half of central Alabama in a 15% probability for severe thunderstorms to occur within 25 miles of a certain point, equal to a slight risk. The next update will be out later this morning. Timing at this point for the threat of stronger to severe storms looks to be from 3 p.m. Thursday to around 3 a.m. Friday morning. There will be a decent amount of instability with the action as it moves through during the late night and overnight hours, reaching around 500 joules per kilogram according to the GFS. Combine that with decent shear and helicity values forecast to be present at the same time, there will be a threat of damaging thunderstorm wind gusts up to 60 miles per hour and the potential for a few tornadoes. We'll have a better idea later in the day today as the higher resolution models come into view for the entire event. For now, afternoon highs on Thursday will be in the lower 60s to the lower 70s. The cold front will be exiting the area during the mid-morning hours with the rain and storms completely out of central, central Alabama by or just after the midday hour on Friday. Once that activity moves out, cooler and drier air will start to move in, but afternoon highs will reach the upper 50s to the lower 70s before that takes place. We will be sandwiched between the cold front to our southeast with a cold front over the northern Midwest region and up into the Great Lakes region. We'll have a mix of sun and clouds with afternoon highs reaching the upper 40s to the lower 60s across the area. Even though we'll have more sunshine on your Sunday, it will actually be a few degrees cooler than what we see on Saturday. Highs will be in the upper 40s to the upper 50s. And for the end of the forecast period, Monday's weather will be absolutely fabulous as skies will be mainly sunny with maybe a passing cloud or two. Afternoon highs will be in the lower 50s to the lower 60s across central Alabama. That will do it for today's video. We are on a one-a-day holiday schedule for this week as James is on vacation. We'll have notes on the blog throughout the day. I'll have the next video out tomorrow morning. I'm Scott Martin signing off for today. Have a great day and God bless. Never wait for hot water again with a tankless water heater from Plumbing Experts. Tankless water heaters are easy, convenient, and now more affordable with a no-interest financing for up to 18 months. Stop with the cold showers and wasted water and call Plumbing Experts today.